Hello everybody! Today we're going to make some pages with pockets in for books, junk journals, all kinds of stuff. Uh, um, all you need is a scrapbook paper for this one, glue stick, a pencil, bone folder, and a ruler. So get your scrapbook paper out 12 by 12, um, fancy side down. You can use a double-sided or paint, stamp something on the blank side because both sides do show. All you need to do is fold your paper in half, use your bone folder, open that up, and measure one inch on either side of the fold that you just made and make a little mark on the top and the bottom. Then all you need to do is fold in the side, the edge to the mark that you just made and use your bone folder. Open that up and fold down the corners to the last fold you just made. This makes the top of your pockets. Oh, I've got some glue. This makes the top of your pockets. All four corners. And fold those corners in. Turn over the paper and fold the bottom to the top. Flatten it and then use your bone folder to get those creases nice. On the top of the page, you want to take your glue stick, you can use any kind of glue you want, and run some glue along the top. Make sure you get the corners real well. And press those together really well. And then you've got your, after you fold it together, you've got your page. You've got pocket here, two pockets in the center, a pocket in the back, and also after the glue dries, you have pockets right in the center here. So lots of pockets to do something with. What I am going to do is get a candy box cover, and I've shown how to do this before. Get your candy box and take out the sides, and there's a seam on the side you want to um, undo very carefully so that it lies flat. Cut off all the tabs. I use this tab that I've cut off to put in the spine of the book just to reinforce that spine just a little bit, give it some more strength. I just glue that in using the glue stick. And then what I'm left with is a candy box cover. And what I'm going to do is take four pages that I've got here, stack them together, find the center, and I am just going to use a rubber band, one that won't stretch too much against this spine. I'm going to rubber band those pages together just like that. And then I'm going to take that rubber band and slip it over the cover to the spine. And then what I have is a candy box book with all kinds of pages that I can put tags in, pictures in, paper dolls in, 
all kinds of stuff. Fast, easy, not too much fuss. You can also use those maps that we've all been getting in the mail. We've been getting the brochures from all the states and they've been sending wonderful maps. What do we do with them? We cut them apart and make pages out of them. This one, I have cut eight sections. Can't see the whole thing because it's too big, but four sections and four sections. So you've got eight sections. It's the same basic thing as the scrapbook paper, but this is what we're going to do this time. Lie it flat and I am going to fold in the corners, all four corners. just to that first fold. And then what I'm going to do is I am going to fold in some of that instead of marking and that kind of thing. I am just going to fold in some of the, th the flap just to make it a little stronger. These maps aren't, they don't have uh, really great paper. And I'm going to put a little bit of glue right there just to reinforce the edge of that pocket. I put too much glue on. I'm going to do that on the other side as well. I'm just going to fold in maybe a little less than an inch, maybe a little more. Just to, to get it all done. A little bit of glue just to hold it secure. And then I am going to fold those in to make my strip. Sorry, it's a little bit bigger than my camera will hold, but I want you to see what you, I'm doing here. So those are going to be the pockets. So I'm going to turn it over and bring the bottom to the top and I'm going to run some glue against the top and press those together and then fold that together. It's nice that the map already has all these natural folds in it you just convince it to go the opposite way if you need it to. So then you've got a page made from a map with the same pockets and the side pocket and it's a little longer and you can put that in your junk journal, travel journal, you can make a cover and just make map pocket journal um, and put all kinds of stuff in there. So it's interesting, something to do with all the maps. So there we have it, an easy fold pocket thing, page, book, however you want to do it. Put a rubber band on anything. You can put all kinds of stuff in them. They're a lot of fun. So this video is part of the Inspiration Conspiracy Video Hub, hosted by Shannon Green. Um, to get to the next video, all you need to do is click the first link in the video description box below, and you'll go to the next video. So keep clicking the first link in each description box until you get to the video you started with, and then you know you've seen all the videos. So it would be great if you would like, comment, and subscribe so you can find us all again. Thanks for watching and happy hopping.